Hey there, it's Tom Romeo from PCS, and here in front of me I've got my Zebra Kiosk 66, no, it's a 600, CC600. And uh, to make this demo interesting, here's what I've done. I've created some badges, right? It's just a little index card with a barcode on it. And these are the people that will be part of that demo. So for my first trick, I'm going to log in as Carol. So all I did was hold it in front of the scanner and it scanned her barcode. Okay. For my next trick, I'm going to act upon some file folders. So you see I've got some file folders and they have barcodes on them, right? So I'm going to see if I can get it in the frame, scan each of these uh, barcodes. Let's see. It's hard to do this. Okay, I got it. All right, so I know what angle I have to hold the folder at. I... Okay. So I'm going to scan the third one. Okay. So you see I have scanned three items, and if I click on this little drop-down box, you see there are three items in the box. Okay, now I'm going to check them in. And you see how it retained my location? And that location is the one we put in in the configuration. If I click check in form, they've all been checked in. All right, well that's cool, but now, remember, Traverse also does color-coded barcode labels, right? And who was that? That was Trump. Who's the other guy we care about? Well, I guess we care about this one too, huh? <laughs> All right, so if I try to scan Joe Biden's tax return. Watch what happens. It says invalid user. That's not, that doesn't mean Joe Biden is invalid user. That means, remember, I configured this to log me out after every transaction. So I'm going to log in now as Jerry. Okay, and now that I've logged in as Jerry, now I can scan... I got one. Let's do the other one. Alrighty, so I've got two. I'm gonna check them out. Okay? And that's me. Well, that's not me actually, that's Jerry's uh, user ID. And I'm gonna say they're due back. Uh, and now check out. And they've been checked out. And you see I'm back to this page again where it logged me out automatically. Let's show what that... So if I scan a file folder again, you see it doesn't like it. You have to log in as a person. So this is great because... Yeah, that's me, Tom Romeo. So um, if you put this device in a file room, and you set it up this way so that you have to, you know, scan your badge before you're going to perform a transaction, you know, it, it works out because now you scan your badge, you scan all the files you're going to use, you do what you're going to do, check them in, check them out, move, whatever, and then uh, when you're done, you're done. You don't have to log out or anything. Or you could set that timeout to be a different value, and then it'll keep you logged in until the timeout expires. So that's it for now. So this is the Zebra CC600 and you see we've got it working nicely with our kiosk program um, and, it, and the scanner on this is so nice. I mean it's so much nicer than scanning from your phone. Um, that's all I wanted to show you. Thanks for watching and remember you can download all of our software from our website.